One of the things that really got me into electrical engineering was trying to figure out how things work and analyzing them to find out how to make them better. Hi, I'm Patrick Mann and I'm an applications engineer on the digital photonics test team for Keysight Technologies. What I've got today, I bought a drone a while back. Uh, this is the drone's remote control, so it's a transceiver. I have it hooked up to a power supply and I've connected some grabbers from the logic ribbon cable to an MSOX 4154A mixed channel oscilloscope. And I've got it, these micro grabbers connected to pins on an Atmel 259 microcontroller. So I've printed out the data sheet to make sure that I've got the, the pin out right. And I'm currently triggering on digital channel zero, just to kind of see what's going on and to see what kind of activity occurs when I perform certain functions on this board. So let's kind of see what's going on. So as you can see right now, I've got the digital channels turned on turn them on, toggle them on or off here, and it lights up. Let me get this going. There we go. So I just triggered on a rising edge on digital channel zero, which is connected to serial data pin, or SDA. And I can zoom in to kind of see what the activity is. But this is kind of cool because you can actually see that we're capturing some data here. And as I perform different button presses on the controller, we're seeing different activity. So D1 is my clock. So when I actually start doing any kind of decoding, we can kind of get a good idea of when the data packet starts and when it stops. And you can usually get all that information from the data sheet and then plug that into the, the serial analysis settings on the scope. Thanks for watching.